Coverage on the Josie High School shooting. Parents are questioning how safe school is. Our Hallie Turner spoke to some parents today to see how they feel and what they want to see going forward. Two parents share the same love for Augusta and the schools they grew up in, the same ones their children now attend. Joseph's a good school. While they don't want the school system to get a bad name. I don't want all the students of Joseph and Murphy to be labeled as bad children, as problem children, because every school has a child that they, they act up. We just wonder how somebody got the gun in the school. Wednesday's shooting made it clear changes need to be made. These things need to change with the metal detector and children do not need to bring weapons to school. On top of metal detectors for the students, they're asking for wellness programs. We need to offer more to the teachers as far as wellness programs, mental health, and I know they have counselors, but the schools need more budget. We checked and per student as of 2020, Richmond County received receives more than $10,000 per student at Josie High School. Murphy Middle, where the fight started in the shared cafeteria, receives about 7,300 a student. And at Butler High, where a fight broke out, they receive a little more than $8,200 per student. Now my children, when you see it, look like it's about to go down, go the opposite direction. They say school leaders can't do it all, and it's a community effort to create a safe learning environment. Safety the measures have to be first. In Augusta, Hallie Turner, on your side. Richmond County School Superintendent says metal detectors are top of conversation right now, but they don't know if they'll be putting them in the school yet. We keep hearing.